Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christian, also known as I Am Simply K, and today's video is a haul. I'm very excited for it. It's an Abercrombie & Fitch haul um, featuring pieces that they've recently sent over to me from their latest fall collection. And I'm really excited to share them with you guys because I really, really like them, and I hope that you guys will too. And now, let's get into these pieces. So first up, guys, is this beautiful faux leather vest, which I really like. I wanted to make sure that I Tried to get it in black when I was ordering pieces. It's just black, goes with everything. It's a neutral color and I like it. Um, but it's definitely a great layering piece. So you can definitely layer like turtlenecks as well as, you know, jackets or a denim jacket underneath or a dress. You can just really dress it up and down. And that's what I like about it because y'all know I love pieces that you can use in multiple ways. So I really like um, the button detailing here. And when it's on me, it doesn't feel too snug, but it also doesn't feel too loose. It's like that perfect medium, and which I really, really like. Especially when you're like layering pieces and stuff, you know, you don't want to like feel too heady. So this is like the perfect, the perfect fit. So I did get it in a size small, and the original price was $99. So um, like I said, these are all pieces that have been gifted to me. And the back doesn't have any details or anything. It's just a regular puffer faux leather material. Up is this white vest that I love. It is a knitted vest. I did get this in a size medium and I really like the oversized fit. And I'll be sure to insert a picture here um, of how I personally styled it. So I have worn this, so I don't know the exact price, but I'll be sure to link it down below so that you guys can have the price. But yeah, I like the knitted material and it is kind of like like a high low top in a way because the front is like definitely shorter than the back and so I really like how oversized it is and I did pair it with a um, white button down underneath it to give it like a layered effect and so I really like it and this is what the back looks like and the wide neck is really cool too it kind of gives it like a really relaxed fit and it's a great material and it's kind of stretchy in a way so I really like it a lot and I definitely know that I'll be able to wear it in multiple ways. Um, I did happen to wear it with some culottes but you know you can definitely wear it dress it down with like some nice trousers and like slacks as well as maybe some like loose fitting jeans and for like a more relaxed fit. Um, as well as like some sweatpants to kind of keep it kind of cool. This vest was really cute and a great staple piece to have because, I mean, even though I know that it's like trending right now, like you could definitely wear a vest whenever you want. So, and don't always just go buy, you know, trends and what's popping right now. It's literally fine. Like you can just still wear things even when they're not technically in style. Um, but this definitely reminds me of like, the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air or like going to like a golf club or something. So I think it's really cool, but I think it's really cute and it's kind of somewhat vintage as well. So, but yeah, you can just add your own spin to it. And like I said, I will link it down below as well as insert a picture here for you guys to see the way that I personally styled it. So next up is actually a dress. And so it's a two piece dress. And the first piece, and I haven't worn it yet, but the first piece looks like this. It is like a, a knitted material again, and I did get this dress in a size small. And I haven't worn it yet, but I really look forward to wearing it soon. And it's like a pretty, I guess you could say like a jade color. Y'all let me know in the comments like what you think the color is, but I'm thinking it's like more of a jade. Um, it's really cute. It's like not gray and like not like bright green or anything like that, um, but it's really nice. And so it's kind of a mini dress and it is like a bodycon. And so this is what the back looks like. It is like a spaghetti strap type of vibe here. And it is v-neck, which I like. And then this is what you put on top of it. So it's kind of like, like half sweaters. So here it is. This is what goes on top. It's like a shrug here and it is long sleeve. And so like I said, I haven't worn it yet, but the shrug was, I did get it in a size small and it is 120. So I will link it down below, but it does, um, I believe, come together because when I was ordering it, I think, I believe that that's what I saw. It was like, it came together as a set, but I will link the direct links down below so that you guys can actually see if it comes together or not. So this is what it looks like and it's super cute. I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna wear it. I probably will wear it with like a trench coat and like some boots um, just for like 
a dinner out with friends or something it's really chill but you know you could definitely dress this up or down that's what i love about knits because it's like they can look very very elevated but you can also dress it down as well with like some sneakers and honestly this shrug you could probably put a bodysuit underneath it and wear it by itself as well as the dress you can wear it by itself as well so two for one that's the deal to me and i like pieces that you can use in multiple ways so next are these faux leather shorts that I still have not worn yet. Um, I think I got these pieces like, I would say last month sometime, so I'm not too late with it. But so far I've only worn the white knitted vest. So here are the shorts and this is what the back looks like. And I got these in an extra small and they do fit a little snug. They're not as like loose fitting as I was expecting, but I probably should have gotten a size small instead of an extra small, but they're cute, they will do. Um, there's just a little bit of a tighter fit. So if you like a looser fit to your shorts and you kind of like a baggy look, then definitely go for like a smaller medium. Cause honestly and truly, like I probably could have gotten a smaller medium because the extra small, they're very cute, but the extra small is a little bit on the tight side. So I think I definitely um, could have taken a bigger size, but they're super cute. They're faux leather. I hope that you guys can see the details at the top and then here at the back. And they don't have cuffs or anything, but they just kind of have like a line detailing at the bottom. So super cute, but if you're thinking about buying them and you don't like a snug fit, be sure to size up or maybe do two sizes up. So next is another faux leather piece and I got a pleated skirt. It's like a little tennis skirt, super cute. Haven't worn it yet. I was thinking about wearing this skirt with the knitted vest, but I ended up changing my mind last minute and was like, ugh, it was a little chilly the day that I wore the vest. So I was like, nah, I think I'm just gonna wear my culottes. So, but I haven't worn this yet, but it's super cute. I love the pleats. It definitely reminds me of like my childhood wearing like little tennis skirts, super cute. And this is vegan leather and it's an extra small and i don't have the tags on this because i thought i was gonna wear it so i ripped the tags off but i will leave the direct link down below if i can find it but again with this skirt if you don't like skirts to be too too snug definitely size up or two because that's what i probably should have done even though i know i'm petite and everything but i honestly probably could have used a small just because i don't like my skirts too too short and i feel like this one's a little bit on the short side but i can make it do but yeah, it, this is really cute, but I definitely probably could have used um, a little bit more length. But really nice, and I love the material. The vegan leather is really good. It's great quality. It's not very stretchy at the top, but it's cute, and you can see the pleats, and it definitely adds, like, extra texture and, like, a cool little edgy vibe to a look. So definitely pick up one if you don't have one already. And last but not least are these really cute trousers loose fitting trousers and they are a gray color i hope that the camera can pick up the gray vibes uh yeah so these are gray and i really like them they have belt loops of course this is what the back looks like um the pockets don't open and they're really cute and they're long and they're kind of flared too at the bottom which i think are really cool it's like I think it's like a really relaxed vibe, but you can definitely wear these to work, but you can also dress them down and that's why I like them a lot. And that's why I was like, definitely gotta get a pair because of course they're like trending right now on Instagram and like Pinterest and YouTube and such, but they're really cute to have also for work, but you can also turn them down a notch and wear them in a chill way as well. So like definitely like some graphic shirts as well as some bodysuits, maybe some sneakers, cute little purse and like, a leather jacket or a sweatshirt so that's for more of like a chill vibe but you can also dress it up with like a button down and a nice top for work as well so office vibes but like i said multifunctional, really cool and i like the way that they fit and so if you're looking for a pair of trousers definitely go to abercrombie and fitch because the quality is really nice and i also like the way that they fit and i believe that they like fit me in the right areas and especially like where like around my waist area and so I don't think that I'll have to like get them altered or like make sure that I have like a tuck in them because they fit really nicely. So if you're looking for some be sure to pick them up and I will add the direct link down below in the description box. So guys that is all for me. I told you guys it was going to be really really short but they were great pieces and so I wanted to share them with you guys and like I said I will leave the direct links down below from what is 
currently in stock and um, if not I will also let you know what's not in stock so that will all be in the description box and if you want to see more hauls from me be sure to like comment and subscribe I would greatly appreciate it and I will talk to you guys again next time bye